All right. We are back, everyone. Not that we've, you know, moved or anything, but we're back. And apparently we're a little hungry, so why don't we go ahead and, uh, some of this. It is a perfect day for it, ladies and gentlemen. It looks like we have plenty of time here. I don't remember if I searched everything. Might as well double check, right? I know I didn't search that. Surprisingly, no guns inside this place. Also, I was curious, so I went ahead and looked it up, and uh, yeah, there's no no other gun stores in the uh, place here, so. In this town, that is. Okay, let's check over here one more time for any uh, useful food. Stuff like that. I think we mostly gathered it all up and put it somewhere else. Um, so for our fresh food, we have all of this. Then we have some more stuff here. So if we do ever need to have food, um, we can just come into here. I will just eat until we get not satisfied but stuffed. That way we have more time to uh, to go without eating because. I'm gonna just carry that stuff around. Doesn't really help us too much. All right. I would take the produce and all that, but at this rate, I don't think it's gonna really help us too much. In fact, it's just gonna weigh us down. So let's take everything we have in our backpack, except for the cigarette, the matches, all that stuff. So we can just go ahead and throw it in our car. Okay. Now, before we head out here, Let's check out the rest of this area. I wanted to open that, but okay. Was this like a tool shit? It's just a dog house or something. Okay. But it was also a building down there we didn't really get to check. Let's hop in the car and head down there. All right. I'm just gonna unlock the doors here. Okay. Give it a look. Ooh. Maybe we can find some tools here. Can we do anything with these barrels? Doesn't look like it. Uh, a Maldru map. Might as well read that. We haven't learned that area yet. Can't really do much else with these. We're gonna ignore that. We have gravel bag, fertilizer. Doesn't matter for us because we're not doing anything. That's going to involve that. Ball peen hammer. Could be useful as a weapon, but I think they're fairly common enough that we don't have to worry too much. We do have another crowbar. Um, I don't think we're ever going to need a shovel, so let's just pass on that. I already have a screwdriver, and then that's plaster, so. Alright. It looks like that's about it. Hmm. Okay. Um, I guess I'll take these 10 millimeter rounds. Not the 10 millimeter, the, the 10 9 millimeter rounds is what I'm Okay. So remember, we were going to take a look at this place because this is supposed to be. Oh, hospitality, not hospital. Medical is pink. Which we don't appear to have any of. But I know there's a clothing store and a pharmacy here. And also, it looks like we passed a hardware store right there. So we're going to try and get near that. I think if we, like, pull up into this area. And then try our best to, first of all, get out of the car around there. We can hopefully... Ugh, that was a little fast for me. We can hopefully search those places without attracting too much attention. The clothing place I'd like to check out because if it has a larger backpack, that would be great. Like a hiking pack, that would be ooh, so good. But, uh, that wasn't good, though. Going fast is nice until you go too fast and the game drags a little bit and you can't see what's going on. It wasn't that quick. Okay, we're still hearing it. Out of the way, lady. Aw, oh, man.
this is actually not ideal. Um, I'm behind the place where I want to be. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. We'll just uh, fantastic. <clears throat> this is not working out too well, is it? There's so many zombies, y'all. That's the pharmacy right there. I want to head up the uh, the clothing store, which should be right there first. So let's put the car here. We're going to hop out. And I guess let's just attract everything we can. And we'll just kind of lure it over to the right. But really, that's all we can do at the moment. Let's try and lure them away. I mean, if I'm with a cool backpack and we can kill it, we could uh, try to do that, but I don't know. Look at all the people in black. Must be a bunch of burglars, huh? We just have to be uh, careful. We don't want to, like, have to trip or anything since our guy is panicked as hell here, right? Actually, that doesn't, uh... Yeah, it doesn't actually affect tripping. Never mind. All right, let's jump this real quick. We got a lot of friends over there. Luckily, the river is right behind us, so... No, get, hit him in the back your head, my guy. Come on. Really? We're going to be like that? Here they all come. I think if I sort of lure them around the edge of the building here, it might help me. We'll see. I can try to lose them through the forest here, too. We'll just kind of run through the forest, avoiding any of the little zombies we see there. Try to make our way out past here. There's still so many zombies around, though. All right, let's crouch down. Hopefully we can sneak past these guys without uh, attracting any attention here. Starting to calm down, it looks like. If I think we managed to get past them. All right, so now if we just go this way. Back, since we are moving slower here. Go past this way. At this point, if we find one or two zombies who are trying to get us, that's fine. We can take them out. But like that, no way. Oh, I don't know if they saw me or not, but I'm just going to keep walking for a minute. Can't check behind us. Yep, they saw me there. Okay. Pick up the pace a little bit. I'm going to run over here. Something else we can go over here and try to that way. Am I getting this lady? Okay. I might be able to get these guys gone. I'm very good here. Which I don't think I'll be able to. Nope. I gotta leave now. Let's lure these guys over here. See if I can make them stumble across that. And then we can hopefully bash them a little bit. We're just going to come over here. Looks like everything's clear behind me. Hello, friends. Come on. Get them all? I did. All right, anything good for me here, guys? Key? Take keys. No, there are four, but I'll take them. We got a new hat here. I also have a satchel, which I don't think is better than my backpack, right? 
I'm never gonna look. I know it's not. Another key. Alright. Let's crouch down. Get out of here. Do I have a, a empty hat on my yeah, I got a random ass hat on my inventory now. Okay. So nice. Let's go ahead and head down here. We'll see if we can get in the back. And I'm gonna assume this is the back of the place here. That's the next door over that they're trying to break through. Okay. Um, I guess while we're here, let's check this trunk. It does open, but nothing that we need in there. Okay. Let's head around the back then. Oh man, I was hoping I could get it back. What? What what scared me? Okay, maybe I can lure them one at a time away from the horde. And kind of beat them up that way. Although my baseball bat doesn't have much life left on it. So once that's gone, we'll be kind of screwed. Oh, a doll. Cool. Alright, let's back up. Oh! Where did that one come from? Man, that one got us good. Like, he had to have snuck on through the trees, this freaking ranger guy. All right. I'm not even mad about that. That was that was, that was was fair. I got snuck on from behind. It wasn't me just doing something stupid. I mean, it was me doing something stupid. I should not have been trying to lure zombies in like that in a place that I, I knew had a bunch of zombies in it. But uh, that, that's fine. That's all right. Let's go ahead, start a new one. Another custom sandbox. Uh, we'll be using this one. We're gonna go with, uh... We were in Riverside previously, and it didn't have much. Let's go to Rosewood, which is the, the penitentiary. And, uh, I think that makes sense here. So, large hordes, no response. It's gonna be the, the in-game stuff, which if I check it, make sure... I'm only... Dang, that, that's crazy. That one bite just insta-killed us. Man. Okay, let's go ahead and reload our Burglar Boy. We're going to be uh, the same kind of thing here. We're going to do a Thief build, more or less. And uh, I do believe Donnie no last name. Well, Donnie is dead. So I think it's time to come up with a new name for our friend here. How about Devin? Why not? Just random name. Starts with a D. It's all good. So I believe this uh, this method of play style, where we're you know getting caught just out on the open, and getting screwed immediately, will really teach us how to better deal with situations and stuff, right? Because before we were like, oh, I died, I'll just re-roll a character, right? But now since we're doing like a permanent death kind of thing. Or if we uh, get nibbled on by a zombie, basically, and they and they get their saliva in us, we're basically screwed, right? So we're gonna have to uh, be careful of that. All right, so they have stuff in here. Um, I guess for right now, let's go ahead and equip the rolling pin. And why not? Let's eat this radish. What do they got in here? Ooh, oysters. Yeah, never eat uncooked oysters. All right. Um, out back, it looks like... Is there a shed out here? There is a shed. Can I get into the shed? I can. All right, come on, crowbar. Battery charger. But we do have a metal pipe, which is going to be better than this rolling pin, so let's go ahead and get rid of that. All right, we won't need the sheets or anything there. Back into the house. So, 
I suppose we could say, oh, what? Why is this stupid mod on? I suppose we could say for this guy, he was in the middle of like a breaking and entering, right? And that's when the zombie apocalypse started happening, right? He was in the middle of trying to, you know, rob this place. And then the zombies came. And now he's just trying to find anything he can to survive. He doesn't care about valuables and stuff anymore. A pipe wrench, I could use that too as a weapon. We'll take that. I forgot to check, was there any, like, cup kind of thing? Or the eraser. Anything? What about this thing here? Nothing. Wow, is that really all that there is in this house? Nothing that I can, like, even, like, no, like, bottles or anything, yeah. I guess I could fill a bowl with water if I needed to. Or that pot, but... Not gonna work out very well, is it? Okay. I already see a sledgehammer right there. Let's go ahead and grab that, shall we? And also hopefully get some good boots from these guys. Helmet as well. Okay. Let's finish this guy off as well. So I don't have to deal with them. Check the surroundings. Looking good. We have a Louisville map. Let's go ahead and read that. We might be going up there, depending on how long we live. Find transportation. We're going to go ahead and grab some uh, better equipment here. We didn't really have much, but we did find a hard hat right off the bat, which is excellent. Uh, this foreman vest. We found a watch. Good stuff. Um, suit pants. Put that on. Put this guy. Ooh, we found a, a key. Is it for that truck, maybe? Here's some jeans. Lumberjack shirt. Maybe desert boots we can wear. What the top guy? What do you have on you? Anything decent? Look like it. All right. Let's go ahead and rip these up. I'll just rip what I can, and then I'll throw away what I do not need. Under the dirty rags. Just want to get something that we can use for uh, you know the, uh, the medical stuff if we need to. And lastly this guy up here. I don't think I robbed him yet. Robbed, I mean looted his body yet. What other mailbox? Ooh, electronics magazine. Doesn't really matter that though. Alright, so that was a sledgehammer. Yes it was. It's gonna really weigh us down, but what we're gonna have to do for now. Ooh, we got a duffel bag. Excellent. Put that on my back. Hell yeah. Oof. Love to see it. We got a hammer, which we can just attach on our belt. And then let's go ahead and put the sledgehammer in the bag here. Um, let's go ahead and place this first aid kit. And we'll just take out the alcohol wipes, add them to our bag here. What else we got in here? Take the metal pipe. Toolbox just has a saw, which we're not gonna use. Twine, I don't think we're ever gonna use. How's this vehicle look in terms of condition? Um, and what's in the glove box? We have nails, annotated map. Read the map. We're in Rosewood. Food up there. Okay. Am I in Rosewood? I forgot where I'm at, actually. Looks like we were. Okay, so this map will actually help us because it has some, some information on it. So food up there. Don't rush in. Remember what happened to Duncan. I mean, obviously, there's probably food there. It looks like it's a uh, restaurant of some sort. Got another Louisville map. Perfect. All right, so we have some uh, lighters. We have a thing like that. We got a bandage. For God's sake. Um, grab all this stuff and put it in the duffel bag real quick. Red, don't need that. Okay. So let's open up the map, plan our, plan our uh, attack here. I'm not sure where the penitentiary is at, to be honest. 
Would it be this large structure? I would assume it's a larger structure. If not, maybe up here or something? I don't know. Anyway, this baby's out of gas. Okay. There was a gas can in here, right? Okay. If we can find a... Um, gas station, we can potentially get gas for that truck, which would be cool because it's a truck. It has a large amount of uh, storage capacity, right? But first of all, let's see what this place is. It is a school, it looks like. I'll be able to find a better backpack. I think you can. Could potentially fill that with water. Another map. Okay. Take these bandages. Okay. More. Okay, excellent. Ooh, find some cigarettes. Nice. That'll come in handy. Another Louisville map. Also got an annotated map here, which is for Muldrew, which we do not care about. So let's go ahead and just toss these back in here. Look for this baby's unlocked, and it has nothing we need. Luckily with these trucks, they don't have a uh, back on them. We can just take whatever we need. Mm, the welder mask. I don't know if we're going to need that. So, ignore that for now. Hop in here, check the... Oh, it's locked. Okay, never mind. Fine. We are stressed, so let's go ahead and have a cigarette. Probably stressed because of all the blood we currently have on us right now. Did I just fucking stop? Darn it. Don't see anyone in there. Bunch of books in there which aren't helpful for us. Okay. I don't see many people inside. You want there though? door over here. Can I get in this door? No. Okay. Let's search the trash then. Real quick. Garbage bags. Okay. Well, how about this room? Okay. Smash the window. Remove the broken glass. Okay, let's climb through. All right. Start looking for school bags or anything like that that could help us out. Right? Even some, like, food would be uh, good to take here at this point. I'm not sure if any school bags would be better than a duffel bag, though. Ooh, we got some chocolate. We also need to find a sink or something in order to uh, get our thirst under control. Okay, nothing in here. That's all closed off. got in here. Surely the receptionists have some snacks stored away, right? Looks like nope. Okay, so I think the uh, zombie that we saw before was in here, or at least he was. He must have uh, gotten out due to the fact that we went past. What do we got here? More cigarettes, which I'll take. Have some vitamins, those could come in handy potentially later. Okay. Nothing too fancy yet. We need to find a uh, cafeteria. This works. Ooh, a bow bar, excellent. More ripped sheets. Cleaning liquid in a broom. 
not necessarily what we needed, but okay. Pot Z. Oh, is that like a corn mag or something? Anyway, drink. Fill, empty bottle. Let's go ahead and also take this time to uh, wash the blood off our clothing. So the foreman vest, um, the hard hat, the lumberjack shirt, and the v-neck sweater would be great. Okay. It'd be cool if it was like a wash all a bloody option instead of just like wash all everything you know we're not too bloody or anything so i think we'll just leave that for now all right but over here next oh we should take care of this before it becomes a problem for us Perfect. Okay, you have a key. Don't know where it's for, but I'll take it. This lady also has a key. Thank you. Alright. Let's get back in here. Oh, is this just a book room? Looks like it. Yep, don't care about that. We have sneakers, which we do not need. A shirt here, which doesn't really help us too much. We are getting hungry now. Lunch bag. Let's, go. Let's place that there. We can open it up. You know, we can take all of this. Uh, let's go ahead and eat. How about a fourth of this sandwich for right now? There we go. That'll hide us over a little bit. Varsity jacket, we can wear that. What does that replace? Nothing. Okay. Bucket hat. Another lunch bag. We also have a school bag here, so it's a 19 and 60, but the duffel bag is much better. Okay, yeah. Never mind. I suppose we could put this in our secondary if we wanted to. Uh, that way we can have just a little bit extra storage there. You know? But we'll start filling up the duffel bag first, since that's where most of our area capacity is going to come from. Okay, perfect. Uh, so that's the bathrooms. Anything else that could be useful in here? I don't think anything else useful would be in the... in the, uh... school. Unless we could find, I don't know, like some bandages or something like that. But finding a, a decent amount of food. Yeah, you know, I might take this lunch box and just kind of put everything inside of it. And if we take this, uh, let's just equip the lunch box in our secondary instead. It's not too much. It's not better than our backpack would be, but then at least it keeps us separate, right? And the backpack does weigh quite a bit as well. So I think if we do that, we can at least keep stuff separate. We're not carrying that much stuff anyway right now, so. Nothing else I want to grab from here. Another lunch bag. Might as well take what we can. Okay. Next plan, where are we going? Um. I guess we can go to the, uh, the main cross street area. Can't do much else. Any anxiousness is getting to me here. Um, oh, we don't actually need a gas station. We could just siphon fuel from the vehicles. Was there a uh, gas can in this truck? There was. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Give me that. 
collecting gas. Yep, how much are we carrying now? Nothing. Yeah, we didn't get any gas from that tank. How about this boy? Collecting gas. How much we get? Is it gonna fill up? It is. All right. That works for me. All right. Let's head back to the away from that horde first of all. Got this. We head back to the uh, the truck we have the key for. That way we can get rid of some of the uh, the weight we're carrying. Which with the sledgehammer, it's it's quite a bit. Okay. If we're safe for now, go ahead and fill up with gasoline. And then I'm gonna wipe. Not wipe. I'm gonna take what I can. Put it into here. We have a bunch of garbage, but that's gonna have to be the way things are for now. Is this metal pipe my weapon, or? Oh, apparently I unequipped it. Fine, whatever. Okay, um... I will store the alcohol wipes too for now. Let's, uh... Go to secondary and we'll eat a little something from here. There's that peanut butter sandwich. We didn't eat half of it now. Go that stacks us up. Let's finish it off. Why not? Okay. How about we also eat all of the yogurt? Okay, perfect. So I'm gonna take the lunch box, put it into the truck here, and let's take the stuff we do not need in the truck, and we'll just dump it outside. On the ground. There we go. All right. I can do the same with the glove box. I can do the same with the glove box. I don't really need all of this. I'll put it in my bag real quick. Hop out. And then we'll just toss everything we do not need on the ground. Racers, though. Thank you. All right. So I think for right now, I'm going to leave the uh, truck there. Um, let's get a icon right there. Let's mark that location. Because if we are traveling with the truck, it's just going to give us a bunch of a noise. Um, I do not want to generate noise right now. So if we and just go get other stuff. And just kind of use that truck as like a, this is where we're gonna use to evacuate sort of thing. That'd be great. And yeah, I'm, I'm keeping the, uh, we got a screwdriver, we can equip that on our belt. Okay. Um, I think the wood glue and duct tape we can take because that can be used to repair items. The wrench we can use to fix our car if we have to. Ooh, a propane torch. Uh, we're going to take that, knowing how rare those can be. And that's to, like, cut through stuff, which is great. And we have a generator here, too, but we don't need that. So, uh, the metal pipe. Give me that. There we go. Because mine is about to break. You know what? Before we get too far away from the truck, I don't know why I was like, here, let's jump over both of these. Let's go ahead and siphon as much gasoline from vehicles as we can here. That's full, and it's full. Nothing important there. Since the truck is completely empty of fuel, it'd be very important to actually fill it up. So we'll do just that here. Since not many zombies seem to be in this neighborhood, we can hopefully do that pretty quick. Yep. Over 
here to this one. I'm gonna step foot in here for a second. Looks like we're clear. Go ahead and fill up our water bottle and take a drink real quick. Okay. Hmm. Even had some canned foods in there. Good for them. All right. Second gas. Nice. The truck is probably not in the best condition, but wait, is it full? It only took two. Oh, huh, it only took two. Oh, that just means that we can go ahead and put the gas can that's full into the back of our truck. That way it'll just be there. Nice, okay. You know what, give me this gas can too. We'll go ahead and fill this one up while we're at it. I'm sure that car over there has some more. Better to have a couple of gas cans than none, right? Siphon fuel. Nothing. Okay. Get up this red car. Fucking gas. Full. Excellent. Is this car unlocked? Nope. All right. We're just gonna go with him. We're gonna sha 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 off into the night. I know there's also a pickaxe there, but pickaxe seems like it's gonna be awfully slow. I really only really cared about the sledgehammer since I can use that to actually break into places. Okay. We've got our uh, basic stuff here. Go ahead, go past our home, and let's see if we can find anything of use. Is this open or is this closed? Closed, of course. Maybe we can also find a survivor house that would have some uh, weapons or something in it. Who can say? I don't know who killed them, but they're screwed. Closed or open? Closed. All right. Out of this. Closed. All right. I'm looking across the street to see if there's a you know a survivor house or not. So. Big Knox Distillery. Bunch of zombies over there. Uh, okay, let's go up from here. We're just kind of gonna walk across this area. I think that exhaustion mark just appeared, so let me go ahead and sit down for a moment or two. Okay. Now let's try to jump this. Hopefully there's not a huge horde on the other side. Looks like we're good. And is this the first building that's green here? It is, okay. So down there we have a court of justice. I'm gonna guess that we have a Police station nearby that. Markson and Co. Just a business. Knox Bank. Oh. They saw me. I don't think I want to go down that narrow alley. Let's lure them away a little bit. Take 
some beta blockers to make ourselves a little bit less uh, enthusiastic. Okay. That's not going to work out unless we have a fence somewhere. Any fences around this area? Not ones that we can use to just drop them over. Hey. I'm gonna kill you real quick. Remember, every zombie we kill now is a zombie we don't have to kill later. Getting tired. Not ideal. Let's jump this fence. That'll exhaust us a little bit, but we can go ahead and uh, sneak past here. For this corner, that should be relatively safe. And we can flip around. So we can get a nice view of the entire area, and we can just wait. Let's jump back over here. Hopefully nothing's on the other side. Okay. That was a risk. Let's try the back doors here. Lock. Ow. And locked. Okay. Not even sure what this structure would be. Get away from the alleyway while we look down it. Okay. Trunks open. Okay, nothing special there. Can we look at the map again real quick? That's a convenience store or something. Oh, he saw me. Okay, perfect. There's just one or two there saw me. I think they were he over there. We don't really care right now. Okay, two of them saw me. We're gonna wait for a minute. No one else is around. I want to get us away from that guy. So we can take him down. Got him. However, our pipe's gonna break here very quickly. Yep. It's been red. Let me come just take you out real quick. Oh, come on, man. I don't know how they didn't get, like, on the ground. There we go. Damage that up real quick. We're also tired now. Shit. Kill this solo zombie, and then we will go somewhere else real quick. Come on, lady. Poor dude, I can't really tell here. We're just going to jump this fence and use this house as our uh, temporary base for the night. Let's equip our, uh, our hammer. Just trying to creep up behind this guy. Mind me. Got him. All right. We already have a digital watch. Okay. Is this door open? No. It's window open. It does. Uh, climb through. Go ahead and fill up a water bottle. Take a drink. Wouldn't close the window while we're at it. 
Okay. What do we got in here? Pipe wrench. Toothpaste vitamins. Hmm. Like I can't fix that, so we'll just do that for now. Hold on a second. I should have the mod to replace the bandage, shouldn't I? Huh. I'll check when we uh, come back next time. But anyway, I can go ahead and uh, rip this sheet into other sheets. Which will give us some extra bandages here. Um, so for now... Let's just try to secure this house. Looks like someone left some food on the stove here. Got a pot of stew uncooked. Go ahead and cook that then. Go ahead and turn that on. And while that's running, take a look at anything that we can get here. Chocolate. Crackers. Tia chips. It looks like. Go ahead and eat these grapes and onions, the, the fresh stuff, you know. There we go. I don't need the pickles too, just to get rid of those. Increase our healing factor a bit. Go ahead and then replace the bandages. How are we looking here? We're going. All right. Oh, a bunch of canned goods. Don't really care too much about. We're panicking because of the blood, but that's to be expected from us. I suppose I can take this canned stuff. We can use that for uh, staple food for right now. If it gets to be that bad, anyway. Check everything else. Just double check. Okay. How you doing? I'll speed you up a bit. And it's cooked. Okay. Then we turn the stove off before we burn the house down. All right. What's this room? This is just the laundry room, right? Yeah. Anything in there? Like, you fixed? Bras. Okay. We have no need for those right now. Bookshelf has some stuff. We could potentially use that to get rid of boredom there. Um, okay. Let's check the little storage closet here. Get ready to attack. Empty. Okay. Let's get to a bed. First room. Clear. All right. Ooh, jackpot. Okay. First of all, go ahead and assign that to our first slot there. We can then go ahead and place this gun case just right there. Which has a MSR 700. Damage is orange. What about this one? Damage is much higher. Okay, but we also have M14, which uses 308s and uses those. I don't know if it's worth taking, to be honest. I'm sure I could take it, but it's a single shot weapon. It's not going to help us out too much with no uh, experience using them. Get rid of this extra stuff we have in our inventory. Um, yeah, I think we might just, let's put this stuff over here, and we can mark down this being a gun location on our map. If I open up that, we've got a gun, we put a gun right there. Okay, let's get some sleep. 
before we uh you know pass the fuck out or something right now, let's go ahead and read a crossword puzzle that does not help at all with our stuff that's fine um all right let's smoke and we clear the rest of the house see if there's any like disinfectant maybe that would be cool Maybe a fanny pack too, so I can put my cigarettes in there and have them be their own thing. Okay. Got a bandage. Any cologne or that? Nope. Bam. Fucking dark in here, damn. Oh, nothing. We have two more rooms to search. So this is just a closet. Let's do that one first. Clear. And it has a leash. Ooh, nice. Can use that to lure around zombies or something. Oh, here we go. This might not be bad. Does it use 45? It does. Okay. Go ahead and put that in our uh, backpack. Excellent. Yeah, that's everything. Okay. That's everything from here. Let's go ahead and replace the bandage, get some new water, and then we'll head back out to the uh, wild blue yonder. Rip sheets this time. Drew it. All right. Fill water bottle. Drink. Let me make sure we're not wearing anything bloody. Our jeans are bloody. Wash. Jeans. And our boots. So we'll wash them too. The guy does not like them. Okay. One more. That. Excellent. Let's head on out. We can just use the back door like a normal person this time. Is night, but not much we can do about that currently. All right. Yeah, I figured it was locked. But what if I just take this key? Duct tape. I'll take it. Uh, let's see. Ooh. There we go. Bourbon, baby. All right. Let's real quick remove the bandage. Actually, wait. Before we do that, cancel. Uh, whatever. Uh, disinfect with bourbon. We'll disinfect all we can. Go ahead and put a sterilized bandage on that wound right there. There we go. Now we have another empty bottle we can use. Perfect. restaurant. I want to go down the street. Fashionable. Probably just nonsense. And what is this building? Some sort of shopping center, I guess? Oh, shit. Yep. We're not going to deal with that right now. Laundromat right there, though. Zombies over there. Goes with medical, huh? Mm, I got two zombies approaching from both sides. Let's head to the south where there's nothing. I'll lure them in. Bash them a little bit. And that way I can at least kill them before anything bad happens. Hopefully. 
I thought we were fine last time on our previous guy, and well, Donnie just went the way of old Yeller, didn't he? Yep, okay, they're gone. Grounds are clear. Check them. All right. How are my stats, by the way? They're doing okay for right now. I wish I knew what this building was. Was it the parking lots over this way? It was just like a generic mall. I really want to get into that medical location. Legal services, and then I can't tell what's past that. We have a haircuts and more, and then the Zippo on the corner there. Do you think I can get across the street and into this building? The answer is no. We got a couple. Apparently that third one was hiding in a blind spot. Jesus Christ, money. I don't know why that was such a slow hit there. came to gosh Isa Hope that's more than five. We're out. Also because we uh getting a little bit screwed there. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and eat because we just got hungry. I actually was gonna eat just because I wanted to lower our weight, but actually happened to just get hungry right about the time, so. Perfect. Alright, looks like some of them got distracted by the Zippos, which I'm cool with. We're back, back is good. I think I can get these guys to, like, break through this, and then I can just bash them in the head. Oh, come on. No, not like that. Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, I guess it worked out. Barely. And now I have a way into the Zippos, too, so... And we have a police body here, which I can probably use to... Get a vest to help me get protected better. Ooh, yep, we're taking that watch instead. Screw this digital one, that one's fancy. Move this broken glass first. Yeah, okay, that's locked. I right, climb through. My skills are just garbage right now. All right, let's search this place while we're at it. Cody, pop, um, and yogurt. Let's go ahead and eat the yogurt. Excellent. All right, this would be a great place to stock up on cigarettes. Junk food, too, I guess. But 
do we really want? Well, we're going to be doing a lot of running around. So this might be the only time we're going to get a good chance to uh, stock up on just a bunch of junk food. I don't care about the sodas. There we go. With that, we can increase our weight and stuff. Let's see. Good cooking magazine, don't care. Farming, don't care. Um, angler, don't care. Let's go ahead and read this. All right. And then it looks like we have a back room here or something. Bleach, nails, bags. The bourbon back here, okay. Our business. Yep, I do not care. You can just uh, stay there, sir. Okay. Oh, hello there. Do you not want to use the one that's already bashed through? Can I search the bodies outside doing this? Well, that one's in. Shit. Oh, fuck you, guy. I actually somehow didn't get actually damaged by that, so that's cool. Don't, like, switch around, my guy. Hey, we gotta go. Front door, ho! Yeah, I'm actually really surprised that I did not get damaged from that. Yeah, we gotta go. We can't doing anything else there shame we lost uh well we didn't lose anything but we didn't really gain much from that other than a bunch of small foods here and there is that a key right there that is let's kill this solo zombie right here increase our, uh, our blunt skill. Okay. I really want to get back to the Zippos, because there's that police officer we have not searched yet. So that'd be sort of important to do. You guys suck. Why'd you go to the door? The windows are open, man. Zombies, man. What? Why did you stop midway that one? I don't understand my guy sometimes. It's like, he almost brought it down and was like, nah.
Hit him in the head. The head. Oh my god. I can't believe there's not a larger horde here just because I've been doing this. Would you, like, beat that door down or, like... There's something else, my guy. Where's the officer? What, what, was there not a cop here? I swear there was a cop. There we go. They don't have anything useful on them, though. Damn. There is another cop down here I thought I saw. Right there. Everybody. Are you kidding, man? You're lucky that I didn't breach the skin. Come on. Kill him. You have a vest. No, but he has a nightstick. And a holster. And a holster. Come on. Okay, let's go. I don't care about his revolver. We need to get the hell out of here. But we're going to go back to where we were before. Sleep there. And that'll be where we wrap things up for the day. I don't know how I managed to like survive those two uh, almost bites or whatever the hell they were. But I'm not going to complain. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth, as they say. Of course, there's a zombie just chilling in there. Luckily, we can just do that. Where'd you guys come from? This house was safe, like, a little bit ago. I'm gonna close this door so I don't get anything sneaking up behind me here. Where did you guys come from? Gotta do what I can with the baseball bat here. Yep. We'll close this window. Oh, Nelly. Okay. That was intense. We really need to wash the blood off of us. First, we need to sleep. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, that is freaking crazy. I honestly cannot believe that uh, we survived that. That was a little bit risky, what we were doing just there. But we now have a nightstick. We can use that for right now. Um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna throw the bat away. I don't. It would be cool to keep it, but at the same time, it hasn't really helped us, right? The attacks were a little bit slow since we don't have much blunt experience yet. So I think a one-armed weapon would be better for now. So we also got that out of our inventory. Perfect. All right. So, folks. I wish I could open up the map while we were paused. That'd be great. So, we're here. We messed around over here for a little bit. There was the uh, the Zippos that we got into, and uh, we didn't really find anything good there, other than a bunch of junk food. What we really want to do is get over, I think, here-ish? Where the medical area is. Because then we can get some medical supplies that'll help us out in the long run. So, the plan for tomorrow... Find a way over here to get that. And then, maybe go down here, see if there's a police station. See what we can find out there. Maybe see where the prison is, because the prison should have guns, right? I'm just not sure which direction it would be off, so. 
I might look that up and go from there. But until next time, everyone, bye for now.